and temperatures around the region tonight on the mild side at the moment, but we will be dropping pretty steadily into the 40s overnight, which is right where we belong, actually a couple of degrees above normal, most likely when you get up and get going. Tomorrow, the uh, average low, by the way, just so you know, is 42 degrees. I've got us coming out at around 45 or 6 to start the day, so a little milder than normal. And you can see right now we're all in the 50s and 60s, no exceptions. Punxsutawney close to being in the 40s at 52, but everybody else doing considerably better than that. All right, here's what happened today in terms of highs and lows. These numbers above normal, the uh, uh, certainly on the high end with 70 in Catanning and Charleroi, 68 the high in Carnegie at the Carlinton Junior Senior High School location. And the morning lows were close to the average low of 42 uh, below uh, in Catanning and Carnegie and just a bit above there in Charleroi. All right, here we are with a look at Highs and lows officially at Pittsburgh International, 70 the high, 42 the low. So we end the day four degrees above those averages, and it's all due to our mild high of 70 degrees. And we should be right in there again tomorrow near 70. Partly cloudy and 62 right now with winds out of the southwest at three miles an hour. And as we go down into the overnight hours, temps are going to drop through the 50s into the mid to upper 40s. Computer models have us progged at 48. I'm going with 45 or 6 for the overnight low. And some of you will stay this mild, and some of you might go to 42 or 3, but that'll be the range overnight for lows. And then once again tomorrow for highs, we should be looking at low to mid 70s. A beautiful day on the way. A gorgeous night tonight. Now, we do have a few clouds coming across the lake in the form of a weak cold front that's not doing anything to provide us with precipitation. But it is bringing a few clouds across the lakes, as you can see, and down into southwestern Pennsylvania and portions of West Virginia. But the bottom line is, with high pressure in control, we're not going to have anything in the way of precipitation. And it's also going to remain mild because with that clockwise flow around high pressure, You'll see those temperatures coming up steadily. Not so much tomorrow as Saturday and Sunday as that high gets off to our east and we start to get that strong southerly flow. So mainly clear and comfortable tonight. Good sleeping weather with a low of 45 degrees. Our high tomorrow, 8 degrees above normal at 70 with plenty of sunshine. And we go into the weekend and the warm stuff comes back. Look at that. Saturday, 75. Sunday, up near 80 degrees. Still mild. Still warm, actually, on Monday, Ken, 77, but showers begin in the afternoon. We'll see temperatures a little lower on Tuesday and a lot lower on Wednesday and Thursday. By then, we're back in the low to mid-50s with partly cloudy skies.